Here's a quick tour of Navio's classroom tools. Select Tap and Teach Lessons. From here, you can either download all content or choose a unit or lesson from the table of contents. Prepare your lesson by downloading individual units or lessons to the device you will use in class. You can delete these units or lessons when you have completed them to free up space on the device. Choose the lesson you want to teach and select it to start teaching straight away. Each tap and teach lesson contains all the content you need to teach a class, moving seamlessly between book and digital activities. Open the carousel to see all the activities in your lesson pathway. You can move through the activities one by one or click on an activity to jump straight into it. As a teacher, you can control the content you see in a lesson by using the filter tool. Select filters to turn components on or off. You have filters for all the books that come with your course, the pupils app activities, plus flashcards and other extra activities that complete your lesson plan. If you do use filters to turn off components, make sure you are not missing out on essential content for your lesson plan. From the filter tool or the carousel, you can also display the book pages associated with this lesson. Zoom in or out by clicking on the page or using the slider here. Now close the book page and the filter tool to go back to the lesson. This label shows you where an activity comes from, the component, page, lesson, and activity number. The units icon takes you back to the course contents. Settings allows you to change your screen display and access audio controls. You can also open the filter from here. The dot indicates that filters are in place now. The rewards icon opens classroom management features where you can award points to your students and organize them into teams. The tools icon opens your pen and mask tools. And the timer is a fun way to keep students focused on a task. Finally, when you're confident that your lesson is just as you want it, you can simply click through the activities using the arrow keys here.